Hey guys, this is iFamous, and I'm here on Battlefield 3. I uh, just started up one of the missions. This is a very popular one. And uh, I'm just doing a benchmark test on it for the Radeon 7850. So, um, yeah, on the top left, you sh can probably see uh, the frames that I'm getting right now. Getting like 70. But that's while recording, it drops at like 5 FPS. And you also have to note that. Uh, my resolution is a little bit uh, lower than most people's because my monitor is a little bit older. So if you have uh, something like 1920 by 1080 around that area or closer to that, um, you're probably going to have a lower FPS than what I'm getting right now. And uh, it also takes account on what kind of processor, yeah, processor you have, CPU. So if you have like a AMD processor, Usually they run a lot slower than Intel's. Uh, it all depends. It all depends, though. I'm running a six-core, uh, 2.8 gigahertz. 2.8 is like that's that's pretty low. Like 3.0 and above, that would, that would be better. But uh, if you do have a better processor, you're gonna get a lot more frames than I am. And um, if I do get an i5 soon, then I will make another video on this. And uh, yeah. But uh, you're, you might be be getting more depending on how many cores it has, and I don't know. Intel's i5s they just run a lot better, smoother, and everything like that. And you can see the temperature up there. It says uh, 56 degrees Fahrenheit or Celsius, which is like really cool for for any card. And uh, it's running at 98% uh, usage. But again, my processor is 6 cores right. at 2.8, so it's kind of like... And then the 50% next to the 98% is uh, how fast this fan speeds are running. And uh, I think I'm going to play this a little bit more, but then I might jump into a different mission and show you guys what's going on in there. This is on Ultra, by the way. I think I'm just gonna get into a little bit of combat over here, especially in the cities like this. Like my my processor can't really handle like uh, large open spaces like that. So that like open spaces, you're not gonna be able to. To, like you'll probably get more than what I am if you have a better processor, like an i5. Oh, whoops! I always get, I always do that too. I always follow the wrong people. Not a single city. All right, just gonna like get shit. into this. Gonna pull this guy away really quick. Maybe shoot a couple people. Then I'm gonna go on a different mission. So I'm just gonna kill a couple people. This is a really really good card. Um, and overclocking this card, this is at stock. Overclocking it just makes it run so much faster. Uh, People say that I can get up to a GTX 580, if you know what that is, that graphics card, which is a $300 or $400 graphics card right now, and uh, this card is on, I got it for 200 so it was a really good deal. <clears throat> and alone, it's, it's compared to a GTX 570. So, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna jump into a different map and I'll show you guys. Hawkins. Alright guys, I'm back. Um, I kinda... I'm gonna turn this down a little bit. Um, I kinda... thought a little bit about the last video and, like, how it's gonna be confusing about processors and all that. But, uh, in the description I'll have something written out on, like, resolutions, your monitor. That's like your... it's your screen. It's like how many pixels are on your screen. If you have a higher resolution, then you're going to get lower frames. So I'll just have something in there. And um, 
I have a website on like what a bunch of games that get tested out and what they play and how they play with uh, this graphics card and um what else processors I'll have my processor in there and I'll tell you like what would be good enough to run this game better than what I get right now it's 2.8 gigahertz is the speed of the processor and that's kind of low for for a processor to be running like this game but uh, I just picked this map it's, it's uh, another popular one that gets tested on a lot getting 80 frames right here Can turn this back up. Here we go, going on an adventure. This game just, I don't know, it looks really nice. Just everything. Press what? What? Oh, did I do it? They didn't even tell me what to click. That was weird. See all the scratch marks and everything. Also on multiplayer, if you're thinking about doing a lot of multiplayer, um, multiplayer takes a lot more processor power. Check flares. Weapons and countermeasures, good to go. Have good ends, good highs, good lows. No outlines, ready in the back. Here we go. Put attention on it. Let's do this. Uh oh. This is probably one of my favorite missions in the game. 